Hey, what's going on? It's Matt. It is another windy day in Northern California. And I want to talk to you real quickly about how I rooftopped or car topped the new Canoe Pursuit. When I had it, there was something that I had access to that was an absolute lifesaver. I want to show you how it works and give you my overall thoughts and viewpoint on it. And it's this thing right here. It's the Rhino Rack. And it is an absolute lifesaver for anybody who's got a large kayak that still needs to rooftop their kayak. I'm gonna switch over to the head cam right now and show you how you get it on. There's the new canoe right there. And one of the things when you have a larger kayak is, is that getting that 13 and a half foot kayak on top of your car by yourself tends to be a little bit of a, a feat. And this really helps. Let me show you how it's done. Okay, so you can see how the kayak is now position underneath the rack and one of the crucial things here is this tension strap tighten it all the way up get it nice and sturdy come over to the kayak lift the nose up put it on the tension strap walk your hands down And the trick here is to keep it as vertical as possible and then it'll slide up, push it forward. And there you have it. You got the hardest part done. Take the tension strap, loosen it, drops it down onto the car. Fiddle with the positioning of the boat to make sure that's on your rack properly mine is not hold on All right, that looks good put the key back in All right lock it down kayak is on top of the car Great thing about it is this is acts as an additional tie down point. To get it off, you would just undo the hitch, have it pull back, and then basically just pull the kayak off. Don't forget to re-tighten this, just kind of lift this up before you take it off, create that tension again, and it'll slide right off your car. That's it, that's the Rhino Wreck. I think I need to hit the gym more. So that is the Rhino Rack. I am going to leave it on top of the car right now because this kayak is going out west with Chris so he can do some paddling reviews on it. Thanks again to Romel, the Rhino Rack. He let me borrow that as well. And of course, letting me borrow the new Canoe Pursuit, which like I said might be a review. I really do like it and I really would buy it. However, this for a big kayak, it's awesome absolutely a must-have if you have to still car top your kayak thanks for watching this thing all of these things don't forget to like comment down below on what you think of this little cool rack loading system don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you soon thanks